Fish oil, aka the nectar of the seas, is taken by many as supplements, perhaps by even you. It's known for its richness in omega-3 fatty acids, which has been linked to a stronger immune system, reduced inflammation, lower blood pressure, and lower triglycerides. All good things, right? However, do you really need to take fish oil supplements, or is it all just a huge marketing scheme? Well, the answer is both yes and no. What? And for you specifically, it really comes down to what you eat. You see, according to studies conducted by the American Heart Association, if you eat at least two servings of fish per week, then you really don't need to supplement by eating fish oil. And the great thing about eating fish proper, rather than just by popping fish oil pills, is that at the same time, you are also loading your body with vitamins, minerals, and proteins. And the great thing about fish-derived proteins is that unlike proteins that come from red meats, fish don't really have much uh, saturated fats, aka it won't increase your bad cholesterol levels such as steak would. Now, some of you uh, could still give some pushback, and justifiably so, regarding concerns that potentially eating too much of wild-caught fish could theoretically increase your blood levels of mercury. However, the American Heart Association still stands with this recommendation of eating two fish per week even after taking the potential concerns of increased mercury levels into consideration. I mean it's just that the pros really outweigh the cons on this one. Now, what counts as a portion of fish is at least three ounces, and per insider tips, the best fish are the fatty fish, which are those that contain the highest amounts of omega-3s, such as anchovies, herring, mackerel, black cod, salmon, sardines, bluefin tuna, whitefish, striped bass, and cobia. Now, if you absolutely but just can't do fish for whatever reason. Fish are friends, not food. Then I suppose you could be supplementing with fish oil. But just keep in mind that you really aren't getting the best bang for your buck in terms of nutrition and all the things outside of the omega-3s that you're taking in. And that's pretty much it, ladies and gentlemen. The choice is absolutely yours. And as always, until next time.